Hi, I'm Scott Berry. I'm a broker associate on Janet Berry's luxury home team at Premier Plus Realty in beautiful Naples, Florida. Today, I'm going to give you a huge tip for landlords that's going to make every landlord's life much easier. Stick around. Okay, with the fantastic interest rates that we have going on right now. Um, I'm working with several customers who are uh, new into the landlord business. They are purchasing uh, rental properties and or they're thinking about purchasing rental properties. And one of the biggest things that I hear from people, one of the biggest fears that they have is um, maybe they're not handy. They're not handy folks and they don't want to have to fix everything that goes wrong um, in a rental property. They don't want to have the toilet leaking in the middle of the night and they don't know what to do. Uh, they don't want to be called in the middle of the night um, with plumbing issues and air conditioning issues. And they also don't want the tenants calling them every five seconds for every little... Th um, they don't want them calling about every tiny little thing. So I have a perfect solution um, which is going to solve a lot of headaches that and potential headaches <laughs> Uh, that <clears throat> landlords and potential landlords are going through right now. So if you've heard of home warranties, I'm going to tell you exactly how. First of all, you can use, you can purchase and use a home warranty whether you're a landlord or not. As, you know, as a homeowner, you can purchase a home warranty. What's awesome about a home warranty is it's basically an insurance policy. And you have insurance on your home if something happens to the roof or something happens to... Um, windows in your home or you know storm damage fire uh, things like that you have an insurance policy that that protects you in those types of instances or perils as the insurance company will call it um, but if you have a the home warranty there's basically a couple different types of home warranty one type of warranty is going to cover the um, systems in the house which would be your air conditioning system, your heating system, things like that. And another one's going to cover um, the appliances, basically, your washer and dryer, your dishwasher, your stove, or your refrigerator. If you have any issues or any problems with your refrigerator's not working, for instance, if you have a home warranty, you just pay on a monthly basis or an annual basis, and you just call the home warranty company. They'll come out, <clears throat> take a look at the appliance or um, whatever system, you're having an issue with and if and they'll fix it if they can't fix it they'll replace it and there are many many different home warranty companies and many many different types of home warranties but let me just run through this quickly from a landlord's perspective if you have a tenant um, in one of the instances I was talking about earlier you you're not a handyman um, but you want to make sure that the tenant takes care of the property and also that they tell you when there's issues with the property so Let's just say that they are having a problem with their dishwasher. Um, the dishwasher is not cleaning the dishes properly. All you do is call, uh, you give the tenant the phone number for the home warranty company so they don't have to bother you. And they call the home warranty company and they say, hey, we're having problems with our dishwasher. This is our policy number. And they send a technician out to take a look at it and fix it. If they cannot fix it, most policies will actually replace the dishwasher. So it's, isn't that cool? There's a lot of um, little caveats to it because there are so many different types of policies. And I'm gonna put a link um, down below this video to uh, some ratings and reviews on different um, home warranty companies and also different home warranty plans. But remember I was also saying that you also don't want the tenant calling you for every small little thing. Typically um, a home warranty insurance policy is going to have a either a trip charge to have the technician come out to look at the item or they're going to have some kind of a deductible not all of them have this but typically they'll have that and what you do is you you basically tell the tenant I'm going to purchase this policy on a monthly or annual basis to take care of the property for you however you're going to be responsible for paying the trip charge or the deductible it's a, it's a nominal fee. It's between $50 and $150, depending on the company. But that way, they're not going to call you over every little thing 
first of all, they'll be the ones taking the responsibility to call the home warranty company. They won't be bothering you in the middle of the night. And second of all, they're going to be paying the trip charge, so they're not going to call about every tiny little thing. So this has worked fantastic. I've used this on my own homes and rental properties in the past. It just works fantastic. And again, you just have to make sure that you find the right policy and the right home warranty company that fits um, perfect in your situation. But this is this is really good, really good solution for um, a lot of a lot of fears that I've been talking with landlords and potential landlords about. So just wanted to leave that quick tip with you. Again, down below are going to be some ratings and reviews. And obviously, if you have any questions about home warranties or home warranty companies. Um, I'm happy to, to answer any questions that I can. I hope this tip has been helpful for you. If there's anything else, any little things like this that um, you want more information about, please just let me know. Just shoot me a text or an email or call me and uh, let me know. We're happy to, to uh, put together these short little videos to hopefully help somebody out in, a, in certain situations.